So I was sitting on the couch the other day with my buddy Justin and we were watching a few things on YouTube and we started talking about, or I told, I told him that, you know, I really wish that YouTube would have a way of discovering new people. And I know that there's the trending tab and stuff like that, but I'm talking about they should have a thing that you could click on that exposes you to new and upcoming YouTubers. And I get, it probably sounds like I'm coming at this from a creator, like, oh, I sure wish YouTube would promote my stuff, but I'm not. However, that would be awesome. I would love that. That's not my actual intent here. What I'm saying is, there should be a section you can click on, even if they wanted to have a limit, like, ah, we, we need to see that you're serious about it, because at the end of the day, you can have one awesome video. Sure, and it might get huge, and you might gain some subscribers, but it's up to you to keep that ball rolling, and I understand that. So even if they wanted to, you know, say, well, we want to make sure that you're serious, you have to have a certain amount of videos before you can be qualified, or maybe you have to have a certain amount of subscribers, that's fun. But I think it's ridiculous that the only thing that YouTube shows you is videos that has millions of views. Now, I fully understand why. Because obviously, if a ton of people are watching it, you're probably going to be more interested in it. And I fully understand that. But I'm talking just a little sub-tab. You've got my channel, and you've got subscriptions, and then you've got, um, you've got like a trending tab. There should be a discover tab. Um, and it should have new artists creating new material that you can expose to that you get exposed to. Um, I think about all the time how many awesome videos are out there that I don't get to see because they're not getting put in front of me because maybe maybe it's got a hundred views and YouTube's not going to promote a video with a hundred views on it. And I know the other side of the argument is people think, well, you know, YouTube's all about money and I fully get that. Um, and these guys aren't making YouTube a ton of money. Look, it's a separate tab. It's not taking anything away. You can still click on trending and all that stuff and see the bigger name, named guys. But I don't think there's a reason to not showcase some of the you know newer YouTubers that maybe don't have a whole lot of subscribers. And in the long run, it's going to make YouTube even more money, and then it's going to help people make money as well. Now, I th some people kind of have this theory that, well, if new people come along, it's going to take the place of these other guys, and you're pretty much just creating a cycle. And I don't necessarily believe that's true. Um, there's two channels, when I first created my YouTube account, there were two channels that I subscribed to, um, well, when I started watching YouTube regularly, there were two channels I subscribed to, one was Big Dos TV, and the other was Alonzo Lerone. Since I subscribed to them, the first two, and those were the only things I watched for a little while, and I've subscribed to probably a hundred other channels at this point. I've never missed any of their videos because I was like, ah, somebody else made a video, so I'm going to watch it. I've still watched every video from that period on of both of those guys, and, and it continues down, the third person. Has to if I subscribe to the channel, I'm going to watch their video. It might take more time to catch up on the videos, but I love these people's content. That's why I subscribe to them, so I'm going to watch it. So I don't think that it's going to hurt other people. I don't think it's going to take money out of their pocket or anything like that. If people love your stuff, they're going to continue watching. So, they, yeah, they, so they could have a little tab, and it can be, maybe even you could separate it. You could have, like, 5,000 and under, 5,000 to 10,000, you know, 10,000 to 20,000. I mean, I guess after that, people kind of start growing themselves. But to showcase videos of these people, and maybe even they should have, a, I think they should have a cool thing where you could set the criteria, like the advanced search in the search bar, where you can search for time it's uploaded and stuff. They should have literally just a button that is a random video generator. You can select, you know, what category it's from and stuff like that. And maybe that's a way that they could pop stuff in there. But I know they're not going to. They, if, if they would do something like that, they would still be popping in videos with millions of views. And again, I fully understand why. But I don't know. I just think it would be good to shed light on some of the uh, newer content makers. You know, because there might be some people out there with some really, really good ideas. I'm not saying this channel does. I'm just saying there might be some, there's some people out there who has some really good content that's just not getting in the right place because YouTube has gotten so huge and there's so many videos being uploaded, what is the chance that I'm going to see that? There could be a guy that lives a mile from my house doing the same thing I am with 372 subscribers, busting his butt, and I'm never going to see that because, I don't know, it's just not getting in front of me. So I think that YouTube can help a lot. Um, I know you can pay for advertising, but you know, I, I just think that it would be something cool to do.
And that's all I have for today. I just thought I would talk about that a little bit. Let me know in the comments below what you think about that. Um, it's just something I thought would be a good idea. Let me know how you think that it should be handled. If it shouldn't be handled at all or anything of that nature, just let me know in the comments below. I love reading what you guys uh, put out there. So thank you for watching, guys. Don't forget new videos every single week. Uh, so hit that subscribe button if you are not subscribed. And I will see you in the next one.